Hi guys, it's Ariel here from Fix My Books to help you fix your books. Hey, so these are the next set of transactions that we're going to do and you will see how we're going to pay the bell bill that we already received. So. The next transaction is on Feb 18, so we paid Squarespace, our website, so we'll click New, Expense, and then we've paid for Squarespace. Make sure that the date is correct, Feb 18, a category is Software, Subscriptions, and we paid $4.84. Squarespace is outside of Canada, so zero rated, and we'll click Save and New since there are a lot more transactions we have to enter. So, the next um, transaction is that we paid the Bell Internet bill. So the thing to do that is to click X, click New, Pay Bills, and there's only one bill. And so we'll click this bill. The payment is 55.98. That's correct. We paid it on Feb 19. So, Feb 19, 2020. And make sure that the payment account is correct. And then we'll click Save and Close. And we paid that bill. And then if we go to our chart of accounts, you'll see that in our checking account, 55.98, it's recorded there that we paid our bell bill. The next is we paid our landlord, Meagle Realty, our rent for the month. So we'll click Expense. And then who did we pay? We paid Donna Meagle of Meagle Realty. And we paid her on Feb 21st for our rent, rent expense. And then we paid the amount 127.36. HST is on since this is a supplier in Canada and we'll click save and view. The next person we paid is Tom Haverford on the 24th and we paid him for advertising services that he did for us. So amount we paid Tom is $46.70 Sales tax HST on, and then click Save and New. And then the next is we paid for MailChimp. We paid for MailChimp on the 25th. It's a software subscription. The amount we paid is 42.93. Sales tax is zero rated since MailChimp is outside of Canada, and then click Save and New. Okay, the last thing that we paid for is TD Bank. Right? Click Save. And then we paid for TD Bank on the 28th. This is Bank Service Charge. So Bank Charges. For the amount of 15.95, sales tax is zero rated. So bank charges, even though the suppliers in Canada, bank and insurance charges are both zero rated. So so bank charges, even though they are a Canadian supplier, bank and uh, bank charges and insurance expenses are both zero rated as well as interest expenses are all zero rated. Okay, and then since this is actually our last transaction for the month, we're just gonna click save and close. That's it, that's how you enter bills, invoice customers, receive payments from customers. It's very easy. 
Hey guys, I hope you liked the video and please don't forget to subscribe so you can tune in to the next videos in our tutorial series here on YouTube. And once again, this is Ariel from Fix My Books and I'm here to help you fix your books.